All right, the Cincinnati Music Festival is happening this weekend at Paul Brown Stadium, but the event is so much more than just a musician. I mean, it'll make your head spin. It yeah. will. It's also become a way to showcase the culture and generosity of the city and the region and joining us to talk about everything going on, and it's a lot. Patty Collins and Jason Dunn, thank you both for being here this morning. Thanks we appreciate it. Us. You know, let's just start right there with what John was mentioning. You know, this has been a music festival in some form or fashion for a very, very Pretty long, long time. time, but its reach into the community now is so much more than that. Try to talk about everything that's going on, and it's well, yeah, a long list. You're absolutely correct. The, the data shows that 80% of the people coming in for the festival are from out of town. Yeah. So that means that 20% are from Cincinnati or the surrounding areas. So there's a lot of people here in the city who kind of want to do something to do. So the Vibe platform was launched by the Convention and Visitors Bureau as a multicultural experience to bring in locals and national people together, thus the word Vibe, to have equity, right? So we're creating events and programs that not only are for the entertainment purposes, but conscious people too. So Ms. Patty and, and her foundation, when she talked about the book bag giveaway, you have the multicultural uh, forum, which is tomorrow at the Western that talks about where, the, where there's a diversity in hospitality and um, 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 music kind of intersect. So the goal is to marry a startup uh, opportunity with a uh, hospitality uh, attraction area to figure out how do we increase the visitor experience, right? And then Friday and Saturday, we talk about the um, Dan Lincoln Institute for Hospitality Leadership, which also is a give back to increase minority or diversity within management positions in hospitality. So again, there's a conscious piece of this, entertainment piece of this, and a give back and we're having a good time on the square where there's 44 um, uh, businesses who you can come in and kind of uh, support who are African-American, Latino, and Asian, et cetera, to have a good time and correct Cincinnati's diverse population. That's yeah, kind of what we're looking for. So much going on. I, and Patty, you got two bites into the apple. Uh, number one, Bootsy <laughs> is going to light it up this week. And oh, play, oh, play. play a little and, bit. And, and, but then the book, the, uh, uh, the book bag uh, 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 promotion is going on. Talk, talk a little yes. bit about what that is and what, what's well, going on. Well, let me say something about the P&G Festival. This year, Bootsy is having a house party. Oh. Yes. Oh. So, <laughs> you, you and I just both oh. did the same thing. Oh. So, so, so he, won't, he won't be playing, but I promise you, you will be surprised with that house oh. party. It is going to be rocking. Oh, so that's that's what's going to be happening. So we'll be opening with that. But Operation Backpack, Groovement Girl Operation Backpack, we decided to give a call to Woodward High School, and we're teaming up with them, and we're going to be giving away backpacks to children underneath of the Bootsy Collins Foundation, along with Jeff Ruby's foundation. He's bought 500 backpacks oh. along with the foundation, and then other folks are coming out. We have um, the uh, Gregory S. Uh, Young law firm that's behind this, Radio One. Uh, it, it's just going to be amazing. Molina Healthcare is on board, closing yeah. the health gap, and all of this is to help the children. August the 3rd, 2 to 7. A, a community thing. Now, have, have all of the supplies been gathered, or is that part of what's happening this weekend? I know there's some stuff going on in Fountain Square, so talk about yeah. that a little bit. Well, this weekend on Fountain Square, what's happening? Yeah, we, what's what's going to happen? We got the funk shit. The, the funk shit. The funk shit. The land. The funk shit will yeah. land on Fountain Square Saturday <laughs> and Sunday. Yeah. Uh, you know, the, the whole Cincy Soul piece is a part of Vice Cincinnati is the kind of the umbrella piece in Cincy Soul. We're marrying that with um, with, Vi with the uh, the funk shit. So you can actually take pictures in the funk shit. The, I think you're going to light it up. You go yeah, we're going to light well. it up on Saturday <laughs> Look night. At John's face. And all kinds of things might happen there. But. I'm having flashbacks right now. <laughs> but what? The funk ship. The funk ship represents love, hope, and peace. Yes. So when we take it around the country, we're going to roll up and we're going to give out toothbrushes, toothpaste, music, instruments. That's right. Bootsy is right. such a great ambassador yes. for the ship. So yeah. we're so excited. And we're like, opening it up for new acts, new groups. There's so much great music out there. Yeah. And and art with our youth, and we're going to display that. Yeah, this is great. All so, right, the so, funk ship. Yeah, so again, we're trying to make sure Cincinnati is open to everybody to come. 25% of the people who come to the city um, are representative of national organizations, so when they come here, they have a great time when they bring the conventions back. Tourism brings jobs, jobs brings dollars, brings tax money as well for us, so again, this is a good time for the region. That's a win, 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 win. Uh, <laughs> the uh, <laughs> Operation Backpack <laughs> distribution happens, by the way, Friday, August 3rd. Yeah. It's from 2 to 7 at Woodward High School. Go to local12.com and click on the Get it tab for more details. Yay! Thank you so Thank much. You. Thank you. Thank you both so much for coming. Thank in. you. Coming Thanks in. for having Brighten us. Up my day today. You're thinking about that starship, aren't you? <laughs> Let me tell you, I didn't hear a single word he said. After <laughs> <that>. <laughs>